patient dying on the operating table is usually considered a disaster, but sometimes it's intentional. Deep hypothermic circulatory arrest is a technique during surgery when doctors temporarily stop someone's blood circulation. At this point, there is no heartbeat and no brain activity. The patient is clinically dead. But why would doctors want to do this? They're meant to be saving the patient, right? Sometimes surgeons will be performing a really delicate procedure, for example, repairing blood vessels in the brain and it's safer and easier to perform the surgery without blood moving through that area. So the circulation needs to stop. But the effect of this is that your brain and other organs aren't getting the fresh oxygenated blood that they need. This is when the hypothermic part comes in. During the procedure, the doctors cool down the patient's body, for example, with cooling blankets or injections of cold saline fluid. This slows down their bodily functions and means that their organs need less oxygen and energy. And for a short period, maybe 30 minutes, the patient can have no blood circulation and still survive with no damage to their organs.